Last fortnight has really been very embarrassing for all India Trinamool Congress as two heavyweights leader Partho Chatterjee and Anubhuta Mandal was arrested by ED and CBI. What is the present status of the party? How will the party come up from you know such a image, such a image, a party which has been built in the name of honesty is now in standing in the question of corruption. We are joined by us, uh, with us, uh, senior, very senior veteran uh, Trinamool MP Shogota Roy. Uh, Mr. Roy, tell me, you know, this has been so long that your party is in uh, you know it's in power, and also in in 1998 the party was born. Is this the highest embarrassment that's what you all are getting? Embarrassment would be a wrong word to use. We have lost a little some face because important leaders of the party have been nailed for corruption. Of them, the case against Partho Chatterjee is open and shut, whereas the case against Onubroto Mondul is not yet very clear. But we definitely have to answer to the people. We have taken a position that TMC will have zero tolerance for corruption. We have also taken the view that anybody who does anything which harms the common man will not be spared. So we are trying to bounce back with that slogan last two days today and yesterday our boys have taken out processions demanding fairness of treatment by central agencies like ed and cbi we shall definitely bounce back but uh, i'm sorry that the, all this happened it's a loss of face the question which is generally raised by the opposition is that, uh, you know, all these things happen, so much of money hold, and the Trinamool top brass, they were just not aware of anything. That's what the opposition is saying. They're putting various questions. They yes, have to say anything that they want. But uh, obviously, we are not aware of it. If we are aware, of, if we had been aware of this, we would have taken some action that we took later. <coughs> so, the party put their faith in certain persons who have uh, betrayed that faith. So, let me say, uh, Partho Chatterjee has betrayed the faith or Anubrata Mandal? Partho definitely, yes. Anubrata likely. Onubrato likely. So till now, there's no, uh, you know, there's nothing much that uh, steps uh, will be taken against Onubrato Mondor? Yeah, it's only two days since his arrest happened. Mm. In Partho's case, we took seven, eight days. Give us seven, eight days, we shall. Sir, Anubrata Mandal was the last word of Birbhum. Nothing would have moved without him. And for so many years, there were so many uh, party presidents of different districts who were changed. Why Mandal was never changed, even after so many allegations? He has said that uh, Hal bombed uh, uh, to police person, Hal bombed to opposition. But why still no steps against Mandal? He was effective and... Uh, there is no doubt that uh, he was a good organizer. So, a good organizer, even if one is rather foul mouthed. But he was not only foul mouthed, there were allegations against be, him. Cannot be dispensed easily. I do not know about the allegations. Foul mouth, I have heard. But allegations. Uncontrolled verbal expression, I have heard. Rest, I do not know. But there has been murder cases against him. And post-poll violence also, no, it was... See, if you are in politics and if you are a little strong type, then there would be such murder case. Question is whether the cases, uh, the, uh, the allegations are true. You must remember that Onubroto took over at a time when 11 TMC workers were hammered to death 
in Shushpur village of Nanur P.S. Onubrata had to tackle with that violence unleashed by the CPM. He is not a product of the Nomul Congress coming to power. He fought in difficult days. So, it is difficult to dispense with a person who has suffered and who has fought in difficult times. So, what's going on? <coughs> the Panchayat election around the corner, it's 2023, and one Secretary General who is inside the, I mean, behind the bars. He's no longer uh, Yeah, he's no longer the Secretary General, but he had an important post in the party, so he knows a lot of things, the organizational thing in the party. The second is Anubrata Pandal is the last word of Birbhun in terms of organization. So, will that not be a effect, will that not have an effect in Panchayat polls? Ultimately, TMC will win the Panchayat polls. Anubrata may have been a good organizer, but he is not. So this, this, all this uh, money haul and all these things will have no effect? Ultimately, those who have got support and strength in the grassroots, they succeed. These things in India, you have really noticed, corruption is not an issue in elections. Even if it is for one election, then it vanishes. Remember Jayalalitha? How many pairs of shoes she had? How many sarees? Still she used to come back to. Well, this might uh, encourage people remember, to do more on corruption. Remember Pratap Singh Kairam, who practiced all forms of corruption, but was an effective development man. So these things really do not wash. Indian people, they are so poor that they do not react to corruption allegations. They say that we are poor people. We know that rich people, big people take money. As long as they serve us, it's okay. There's been a change in, you know, block precedents and all of that's been in the process today. Three districts, uh, uh, this thing has come up. And uh, there, the priority which has been seen is clean image people who can do good coordination, Bhumi Putras, they have been given... So you, uh, the Trinamool is really doing a rebuilding, uh, uh, corruption-free Trinamool? But will it be possible? It's right to. Obishek sir has taken on this responsibility and he has employed survey teams to survey places, make survey about ground realities, about reputation of Tirumul leaders. So, new lists are being formulated with that in mind. Uh, so, you think that this will work out, the new team with six months uh, of... One can only hope. Hmm. What is so definite in politics? Hmm. We can try to pursue a certain way, which we are. And what about the, na the direction. Yeah. And what about the national ambition of Trinamool Congress? Don't you think that you know entire nation has seen that so much of money has come out of Partha Chatterjee's close resident, a uh, close aid? You may say that he's no more in the party, but the time at which this well, money I came said, out, he was there. As I said, the, this was seen. this was a blot on us, made us shame faced, we lost face. But we'll have to recover. A political party can't just lie back and say, well, we don't care. But do you think it's going to help BJP? They are all out with this uh, issue in of Bengal, chore, chore no, and everything. No, no. In Bengal, BJP will be nowhere. Our calculation is that BJP may not get five seats in the next Lok Sabha elections. Oh, yeah, you are very confident. One last question to not you. Me, party did a survey and that's the result. Okay, okay, that's great. Another last question to you, uh, Mr. Roy, is that you have been from the very first day with Mamta Banerjee. She has been known for honesty. She's a chief minister who stays in a very small residence. Don't you feel bad that, uh, you know, your party is facing charges of corruption? I, of course I feel bad. And it's true that Mamta has been an epitome of honesty and simple living. Her lifestyle was the most attractive matter about her. We have received a hit. Let's see how we do. Who is responsible for that, you know, so that, you know, there's a tag that, of corruption. That will take time to find out. 
can't say anything. So here was Shogutu Roy who really feels bad for Mamta Banerjee because it's a party which built up on honesty but now it has a scar of corruption on it, the allegation of corruption on it. But he's confident that in Lok Sabha polls, BJP will not cross five in Bengal. This is Kumalika Sengupta with Angshuman reporting from Kolkata for CNN News 18.